Welcome to the lecture. If you want to become a certified software professional and you want to accelerate your career, you want to stand out on the job interview, you have to pass SOLIDWORKS certification exam. How to take this exam and how to pass this exam, find out on the end of this lecture. If you find this video useful, click like and subscribe. In this lecture, we're going to show how to create isometric section view. To create isometric section view, first, we have to create a standard section view that we've shown in this section. So we have this view and we want to make a section here. So we have to go to view layout and choose a section view. So we're going to go with standard cutting line, vertical, and let's check auto start section view. So now we can position where we want to make a section. So we're going to make a section here. And now we can drag this to the left or the right. And we can leave this here. Now we have a normal standard section view, section BB. Let's click OK. And now if we want to make isometric section view, we can just right click on it and here we have isometric section view and just click here and now we got isometric section view you can also change a name here you can flip direction like this we can go with something like this and you can change display style we can go like this and you can change scale Let's go one to one and OK. And now if we move this, we see that we can position this where we want. We have to break alignment. So we can just simply right click on it, alignment and break alignment. And now we can position this isometric section view where we want. For instance, here. OK, we can move this here and OK. And this is how you can create isometric section view. If you're tired of watching on YouTube videos and buying cheap courses, who always leave you wishing and wanting for more, and you want to have personal support to learn the SOLIDWORKS from the absolute zero to the professional level to improve and start your career, Check the link below and visit our Super SOLIDWORKS Accelerator Academy. As well, if you like this video, click like and subscribe.